we will no longer participate in this violent, illegitimate sham of an election process. Shortly after announcing he was dropping out of Zimbabwe's presidential race, Morgan Zvangarai dropped out of sight. The opposition leader is holed up in the Dutch embassy, saying he fears for his safety. Police Monday raided his party's headquarters and detained dozens. He arrested uh, over 60 uh, of our people who were at the Avis house, mostly victims of political violence. You're talking about women and babies. Reaction from world leaders has been swift. As a number of African presidents and ministers have already stated, the regime has made it impossible to hold free and fair elections in Zimbabwe. And state-sponsored terror and intimidation has put the opposition in an untenable position. It's clear that the, uh, the country is in crisis, a political crisis, a crisis of legitimacy. Without a runoff election that's fair, that people can have confidence in, uh, the, the government cannot be legitimate. Zangarai won the first round of the presidential election against longtime leader Robert Mugabe back in March, but not by enough to avoid a runoff. Since then, the election has been marked by violence. Human rights groups say 85 people have died and tens of thousands have been forced from their homes. Mugabe's officials say the runoff will go on as planned this Friday. Dutch officials say Zvangarai has not requested asylum. Diane Kepley, The Associated Press.